Super cool dude, super lightweight. It's the size of a cell phone, for real, when you pack him up. A very cool toy, uh, not only on an amateur level, but a professional level. I mean, this dude is awesome. Hey, what's up? I'm Joker. Welcome back to the Chill Factor channel. Uh, today, we're going to be doing a little bit of unboxing. We're going to be checking out this new drone that I got for our short horror film that we're producing. This is the DJI Mavic Mini. It is super, super cool, super badass, and I'm here to tell you a couple reasons why I think so. First of all, if you buy this little bad boy, he's only 400 bucks. If you upgrade and get the package where you get a extra batteries, extra guards, and extra fan blades, and all things like that, then he's only five. Uh, it's actually a really good deal considering the prices of other drones out there right now. And for what you're getting, picture-wise, the duration of your flight, a lot of other things, he's really hard to beat. And trust me, I shopped for a while and I wanted to make sure that I was going to get the best bang for my buck. And after test driving this little baby, because we just got done filming the majority of our new horror short called Not Alone, I can proudly say that this is amazing. Now, when you purchase the big boy kit, you actually get the traveling case and all the extra doodads that might come with it. Let me go ahead and show you who we call Dennis. He has been labeled Dennis the Menace for a reason. He is amazingly small, first of all. Let's take that into consideration, okay? And let me tell you why you should take that into consideration. Due to government regulations, if you purchase a drone, and I'm new to this game, okay? I've never owned a drone. I've never done anything like this before, okay? So reading the reviews, watching the videos here on YouTube, things like that, I learned a lot uh, from a lot of wise people. And one thing I did learn about is it's actually advertised through the company too for a reason. Bam, right there falls below 250 grams of weight, okay? So what that means is you don't have to actually register him with the government. No Uncle Sam looking over your shoulder while you try to enjoy whatever you're trying to get. Boom, 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 boom. Put the battery in the back, take your gimbal cover off, and he's ready to go. Now I haven't tested him fully as to what he might be able to do. I've only taken him up to about 450 feet, which is about 50 feet above actually what should be regulated, but that was clearly an accident. <laughs> he flies fast. Uh, I've got him up to almost 10 miles per hour. Uh, I mean, as long as you can fly him correctly and don't run into things, trust me, I ran into a few things while we were filming, but you know what? No worse for the wear, right? I mean, this is him. I haven't done anything with him after he hit about four trees. So I'm gonna say the durability, thumbs up. But I do love him, I love him. Uh, something else that I did notice after watching some reviews and stuff of uh, drones and whatnot. The gimbal here, uh, he has a three point gimbal, what they call a three point gimbal, which basically means like if you, if you shift him this way and he's going this way, the gimbal would actually turn to level eyes. That gimbal stays exactly where you tell it to stay in your phone. And that kind of brings me to uh, moving on over to some of the controls. This is the controller that you get, all right? Boom, all compact, all complete, right? Put your phone in there, all right? Hooks up right here through the cords that they provide. And then uh, you're pretty much ready to go. You just download the, the DJI Fly app. It's, it's super easy to use, super easy. Go through the settings, figure out what you want, figure out the sensitivity of the camera. You can set a home location every single time you take off. And that way if something happens, you can hit the home button right here, boom, boom, and he will come straight back home. No harm, no foul, as long as you don't hit anything on the way. The DJI app actually gives you four presets. I found very vital for my filming I hope to show you some of them here.
I can go ahead and speak very proudly. He was an absolute trooper in everything that we filmed. I mean, everything from, you know, 400 feet to, you know, 50 feet above the ground, uh, the automatic preset uh, camera movements, capturing shots for me. The one mistake that I did make in a couple of the shots of filming was his noise. But, you know, when you dub in audio for the, uh, the tracks you're working on later on, not such a big deal, but it's just something to keep in mind. I mean, a drone does make noise, so uh, with me, I like to capture several different angles when I do film. So, I mean, I have three to four cameras going at once, this being one of them in this case, and didn't really take into consideration in a few shots that he was hovering above and then I go back and look at the other footage, hear the other footage, and I can actually hear him faintly in the background. But it did affect uh, a few shots, so you know, keep that in mind. If you're, especially if he is, you know, a perspective that's, I'm gonna say, less than 50 feet, you're gonna hear him. If I actually had to rate him on a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna go ahead and give him a 10 because I really don't have anything to compare him to. I've never owned or flown a drone prior to this fella right here, but I'm telling you, for beginners, amateur drone flyers, not only the best bang for your buck, super easy to learn how to use. And let's go ahead and talk about the camera quality, okay? Everybody wants 4K, 4K, that's the thing, right? This little guy, his camera fl flies a little underneath the 3K value of a good shot. So you really don't notice the difference. You break it down in the editor, you look at it, you're like, this is still super high quality. I cannot say enough good things about this little guy. I love him so much. Dennis the Menace, everybody. You Chill Factor fans out there. Dennis the Menace. You will see him doing a lot of things for us. Might even put a little sheet over him and just let him fly through the haunt as a ghost. Who knows? I don't think that would really work out too well with the propellers. But we'll find that out as we come to it, okay? I hope that you found this informative. Um, it is a really cool drone. Uh, if you are just somebody who's looking to get into the game, you just want to fly them as a hobby, or if you're looking to film some cool stuff, this is the best bang for your buck. And I'm telling you, I shopped for six months. I shopped for six months. Making sure that I was going to get my money's worth, making sure that I was going to get the quality that I wanted, the controls that I wanted with the controller and the adapter with the phone and whatnot. Fabulous purchase. Wonderful please check it out. It is the DJI Mavic Mini. It is a badass. It really, really is. Anyways, that is all for now. We do have a lot of other unboxings and things of that nature coming at you soon. Oh, hello. Anybody like the movie Dead Silence? I do. Like and subscribe. Follow. See you next time.